Welcome to iTech Tutorial. In this video, I will be showing you how to draw the above Tang in C problem. To draw the above Tang in C problem, the first thing you are expected to do is to draw a horizontal line. The horizontal line should be a thin chain line. I have already drawn my horizontal line. I drew a horizontal line of length 180 mm. The next thing I will do is to draw a vertical line. The vertical line should intersect the horizontal line at the middle. Next, I will draw a line from the point where the vertical and horizontal line intersects. The line should be inclined at 30 degrees to the horizontal line. I will repeat the same procedure for the left side. Next, I will mark a point on the vertical line. The point should be 45 mm below the horizontal line, then I will draw another horizontal line. Next, I will mark two points on the horizontal line below. The two points should be 37.5 mm from the point where the vertical line intersect the horizontal line. After marking the points, I will draw a vertical line passing through each of the points. Next, I will draw a circle of radius 16 mm. I will bisect the angle of the line inclined to the horizontal line at the right. I will repeat the same procedure for the left inclined line. I will draw another circle. The radius of this circle should be 25 mm. I will draw a semicircle of radius 60 mm. Now I will draw four circles of radius 12.5 mm each. This circle should be on specific points of intersection. Now it is time to produce the tangential arcs. To produce the tangential arc, I will cut two arcs by placing my compass on the center of two circles. The radius of my compass should be the radius of the tangential arc plus the radius of one circle. The arcs should intersect. Now I will place my compass on the point of intersection of the arcs, then I will produce the tangential arc. I will do so using the radius of the tangential arc. In this video, the radius of the tangential arc is 40 mm. I will repeat the same procedure to produce the other tangential arcs.
draw a line joining the points where the vertical line intersects the two circles at the bottom. Now I will make bold the parts of the drawing that are supposed to be bold. done solving the tangential problem but it is necessary for me to dimension it. Tangential problem has been solved successfully. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any question, you can drop it at the comment section. Please subscribe to this channel. Also let us know your opinion and how you feel about this video. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you find it helpful. See you in my next video.